As you know, YouTube offers a free way for anyone to share their video files with the general public. Now, although YouTube accepts video files, it doesn't allow audio files. However, you can still use YouTube to share your audio files with the public. You just need a simple program or video editing tool to convert your audios into a video file and then upload it to YouTube as an audio video file. In this video, I'm going to show you a simple tool that you can use to upload your mp3 files on YouTube and we are starting right now. Hi, I'm Winston the Solopreneur Warrior and in this video, I'm going to introduce you to a cool web-based tool that will help you easily upload your audio mp3 files to YouTube. But first, if this is your first time to this channel and you're interested in making money with the videos you upload on YouTube, make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's get started. Now, the manual way of uploading an mp3 file to YouTube will require you to get a video editing tool, even just a basic one. You can make a search on Google and download a free video editing tool to use. With a basic video editing tool, you can upload your audio file, add some images or recorded video clips and render it into a video before uploading it on YouTube. Now that's just the manual way. There is also an automated way of doing the same thing using a web-based app called Wavy. On Wavy, all you need is your audio file and a single image to create an animated audio video like this. The Wavy web-based tool will take your audio file, match it with the wave vibration and create an animated engaging video file that you can easily use to upload on YouTube. Just check out this short video clip on how to use Wavy to upload your audio mp3 files to YouTube. Here at Wave, we found that adding an audio waveform animation to videos along with an image and the audio content is the best way to grab the attention of YouTube viewers. Let's walk through a quick demo of how you can use Wave to turn your audio into YouTube videos that look like this. The only things that you need to get started is a free Wave account an audio file, and an image. First, let's go create that free Wave account. Now that we've logged in with that new account, our first step is to create a new design. Wave provides a concept called cards, also known as designs. Think of them as templates that include an image, a waveform, and text. You combine the cards with audio to create video clips, which you can then share on social media including YouTube. Let's click here to create a new design. There are three design layouts to choose from. For YouTube, the horizontal is always the best. Feel free to experiment with the other layouts if you're wanting to create audio visual posts for Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. Next, let's use the editor to configure our design. This includes a background image, a waveform animation, and text, which is optional. Be sure to browse through the waveform animation libraries and find the best one that fits your design. Be sure to play around and get the design exactly how you want it. But don't worry, you can always come back and edit this design as many times as you want. Also, we're always adding new waveform animations to the library, so be sure to check back regularly for updates. Once you have the design just how you want it, click Save. Next, let's head to the Create page. This is where we'll be able to select our design and upload our audio file. If the audio file is longer than the segment that you want converted to a video, just drag your cursor or mouse into the audio bar and click and drag to trim to a smaller segment. You can preview your segment and even listen to the last five seconds to make sure it's just right. When you're ready, hit generate. Once 
Once the video completes, it will be available for download in the My Videos page. Just download the video and upload it directly to your YouTube account. You can also connect Wave to your Facebook or Twitter account and share it directly there. And don't forget, you can share this Wave video anywhere that supports MP4 file uploads. So be sure to put it on your blog, Instagram, or any other platforms that you utilize. Now, if you would like to check out the WV2 for yourself, I will drop the link to the website in the description box below this video. And with all that, I will call this video a wrap. I hope it was helpful. If so, hit the like button below, share on your preferred social site, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss another helpful video.